Hello everyone, welcome to Math is Fun. Our lesson for today is all about formulating the rule in finding the next term in a sequence. Let's read the problem. Seven days before his mother's birthday, Jan planned to give her gifts. On the first day, he sent one gift. On the second day, he sent three gifts. On the third day, he sent five gifts and so on. How many gifts did Jan send to his mother on the seventh day? To answer our problem, we're going to use a table. For first row, it represents the day. For the second row, it represents the number of gifts. So, for the first day, her mother received one gift. For the second day, she received three gifts. For the third day, she received five gifts. For the fourth day, unknown. Fifth day, unknown. Sixth day, unknown. Seventh day, unknown. Upon observing the number of gifts, one, three, five, and so on, so, the pattern is we're going to add 2 from the preceding number. So, 1 plus 2 is equal to 3. 3 plus 2 is equal to 5. 5 plus 2 is equal to 7. 7 plus 2 is equal to 9. 9 plus 2 is equal to 11. 11 plus 2 is equal to 13. The pattern rule is add 2. His mother will receive seven gifts on the fourth day, nine gifts on the fifth day, eleven gifts on the sixth day, and thirteen gifts on the seventh day. Therefore, his mother will receive thirteen gifts on the seventh day. There are problems in mathematics that can be solved by observing sequences and patterns. A sequence is a list of numbers or objects in a defined or logical order. Patterns are repetitive sequences and can be found in nature, shapes, events, sets of numbers, and almost everywhere you care to look. Find the next three terms of the sequence, 3, 7, 15, 31, and so on. So, what is a pattern? 3 to 7, the pattern is 3 times 2 plus 1. The answer is equal to 7. Next, 7 times 2 plus 1 is equal to 15. 15 times 2 plus 1 is equal to 31. 31 times 2 is equal to 62 plus 1 is equal to 63. 63 times 2 is equal to 126 plus 1 is equal to 127. Lastly, 127 times 2 is equal to 254 plus 1 is equal to 255. Therefore, the next three terms are 63, 127, and 255. The pattern rule Multiply by 2 and add 1. Find the next three terms of the sequence, 27, 23, 19, and so on. So, for 27 to 23, the pattern is minus 4. 23 to 19, the pattern is still minus 4. So, 19 minus 4, the answer is equal to 15. 15 minus 4, the answer is equal to 11. 11 minus 4 is equal to 7. Therefore, the next three terms are 15, 11, and 7. The pattern rule is minus 4. Find the next four terms of the sequence. 1, 5, 17, and so on. So, let's evaluate the sequence. 1, 5, 17. And what is the pattern? So, for 1 and 5, the pattern is 
times 3 plus 2. 1 times 3 is equal to 3 plus 2 is equal to 5. 5 times 3 is equal to 15 plus 2 is equal to 17. 17 times 3 is equal to 51 plus 2 is equal to 53. 53 times 3 is equal to 159 plus 2 is equal to 161. 161 times 3 is equal to 483 plus 2 is equal to 485. 485 times 3 is equal to 1,455 plus 2 is equal to 1,457. Therefore, the next four terms are 53, 161, 485, 1,457. And the pattern rule is multiply by 3 and add 2. I hope that you understand our lesson for today and thank you for watching.